Welcome to episode number two of Our Favorite Places. Today, we're off to a little town where people literally love to watch paint dry. You don't want to miss that. Hi, I'm Arnie, and this is Arnie Jacobson TV, where we talk travel, camera gear, and tech. If you're into that kind of thing, why don't you consider subscribing? Just click that big red subscribe button down below. Don't forget, click that bell icon so you'll be notified whenever we put up new content. Welcome to Toppenish, Washington. Now, it's a pretty windy day, so I'm hoping the audio is going to be okay, so <laughs> bear with me. So yeah, we're in Toppenish. It's, it's a little town in central Washington just off of I-82, and it's a place where people love to watch paint dry. Yeah, I'll talk about that in just a minute. Right now, I'm sitting in Old Timers Plaza, and uh, this is a small little town where, where uh, they claim where the West still lives. The reason we're here is because this town is known for its murals. The murals are here to kind of represent the history of this place, the history of the Old West, the history of Toppenish, and um, there's some 78 different murals in this town. It's amazing to walk around here, and we're going to do that here in just a second, and see all these different murals covering the full side of many, many buildings. As I mentioned, people love to watch the paint dry. The first Saturday of June, they have a mural in a day where they bring in a bunch of artists and they do a complete mural in one day. It's a big deal. People come from a long way away just to see this happen. It must be, I've never seen it, but it must be quite the thing. Let's go take a look at some murals. Now this is mural number one called Clearing the Land. Now we're not going to go through over all of these, but I thought you'd like to know that. I'd have to say that Toppenish is a nice little stop if you're into history and appreciation for local art. This little town of about 9,000 people sits within the boundaries of the Yakima Nation. And surprisingly enough, travelers from all over come to see this. I've never been any place that has as many murals as are exhibited here in Toppenish. And if you don't want to walk around, you can always take their guided tour, horse-drawn tour. The guide will take you to every single one of them, and you'll get to know more than you could have probably ever wanted to know about each and every mural. So there you have our quick stop in Toppenish, where the West still lives. If you're driving along I-82 in central Washington, why not swing in for a couple of minutes, enjoy the town, enjoy the murals, enjoy the, the uh, train museum. Hey, if you like this kind of content, why not subscribe, leave a comment down below, particularly if you have places in Washington State that you can recommend for us to check out. Give us a thumbs up and share. We do appreciate it. Thanks for stopping by.